This tutorial shows you how to use files stored in other geographic formats in Maptitude. Maptitude supports numerous GIS and CAD formats, including Esri shapefiles and ArcView project files and legend files. To open a geographic file and see it in a new map, click the File Open button. First, choose the file type from the drop down list. For example, you could open an ArcView project file, an Orange survey file, a digital elevation model, an OpenStreetMap, an AutoCAD DXF, or in this case, I'm going to open an Esri shape file. Pick a file and click Open. If you'd like, you can enter a name for the layer as it should appear in Maptitude. Also, you will often have the option to import the layer. If you want to convert the layer into a Maptitude format, check this box. Otherwise, leave it unchecked to use the file in its native format. Maptitude opens the layer and displays it in the map. Just like any other layer, you can add labels to it, change the style, add a theme, etc. For example, I will add a color theme using the primary use field. And because I know that there are no overlapping areas in this layer, I will uncheck this box so that the theme will show as a solid fill rather than a border color theme. You can also add other geographic format layers to an open map. For example, to add layers to this map, I'll simply click the Map Layers button and click the Add Layer button. Again, choose one of the available geographic file formats and choose one or more files and click Open. Again, you have the option to rename the layers in the Maptitude map. You can also change the style of the layers. Right now, they have the default styling, but I will change the earthquake layer to a different color and size. I'll also move it down so it displays after my seismic hazard layer. Now click close and you'll see the map with the new layers. Again, all of the data are available too, so I could, for example, create a scaled symbol theme on the earthquake layer using the magnitude field. and add a color theme using the type field. And that wraps up this tutorial on using other geographic file formats in Maptitude.